Hey everybody, it's Blue Totem. Welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. Now I have to say that a few videos ago, I don't know how many it was, it was probably more than a few, I ran into a shiny <coughs> and didn't know about it. Phalanx, the Phalanx army in the comments pointed out that there was a, I can't remember what it's called, hang on. I can, I can figure it out. It's like a, I think I, I think I know what its name is, but I'm not going to remember, I'm not going to be able to say it correctly unless I look at it. Which will take me a little bit because I have to go through all this. Why does the icons change like this? I found a Makuhita, but it was red. It had red lines and stuff on it. And I didn't notice it was different because I haven't, I don't know this Pokemon very well. But it was on screen, right next to me basically. And then it walked away while I was in a fight and I didn't see it. So that's the that's the shiny that we could have seen and collected maybe, but I don't know. It's definitely not as obvious as in other generations of Pokemon. Where they actually have sparkles around them. But anyway now, I'm probably gonna run past so many more shinies. In fact, I could even already have walked past another shiny. Probably not, but it's always possible. Nope, we're good. Okay, so, I think I should probably go somewhere else now, and try to explore a bit more. I should probably check the map. I'm getting a little bit better at going through buttons. Not extreme much better, but better. So, we have a lot of stuff left over this way. That's pretty much all that there is, actually. It's kind of crazy to think about. So I guess I'll just go in this direction. We can climb up walls now, which is helpful. Let's see how well I can actually use that, because that, that's all, that's where it's going to really matter. I think I fought most of these other people. Not you though, apparently. You been to Medali? Medali's famous treasure eatery gets a one-star review from me. Well, that's rude. Why? Emilio the student. Sent out a Tauros. And I sent out a Rotom for some reason, I don't know. She's discharged just because... She'll be fine. I'm still slightly overleveled, but... It's... Balanced out a lot more since we... Were... Where we were before, when we were just overpowered at the very beginning of the game. Your battle skill is 5 stars. Thank you. I guess I'll take that, but I still can't forgive you for what you said about the other place. I will not forgive you. I don't know. I'm probably just going to fight more Pokemon, possibly. Well, I guess if I've already fought some of these Pokemon in the wild, I probably don't need to fight them, so... Well, so why... why, why are there repels in this game? I don't know. That's another question that I have. Another question that I have... Uh, no, not a question. Something else I wanted to point out is how little trees there are in this game. I mean, yeah, there are trees, and there's a lot, lot of trees on screen here. But Pokemon, every other Pokemon game, basically, has just trees everywhere. <laughs> Hee hee, I'm kind of the main attraction at my cafe. Cool. Elsa the waitress. Also, I haven't played this since last year, so hopefully I'm... Still all right at it. Took a few weeks off just doing other stuff, but now it's 2023, so I should probably get on back, get back onto it. That way, I can upload some more stuff. Maybe as long as I keep up with editing stuff. Hey, don't steal my peel. Okay, I will not. You can keep it to yourself. Nobody else wants it. Slightly rude, but anyway. It's a, it's a ca character in a video game. Let me just heal. Why was I sliding sideways? Also, why do they pop in? It's fine. Let's heal my Pokemon. I really need to train up my Pokemon a lot more before the end of the game, although I'm probably going to be doing stuff after the end of the game anyway, so... I think I've played, like, the first region... <laughs> of Pokemon Silver, Soul Silver, since the last time I played this, which is weird to think about. Have I really not played this in that long? I guess so. Yeah, wow. 
because I've been doing a few Pokemon races with my friend who I've yet to challenge in this game. I thought that tree was like a Pokemon. That's That'd be scary if that tree was a Pokemon. Uh, but I, we raced through Shining Pearl and beat that... Well, my friend beat that in nine hours. I'm still stuck grinding probably until I'm better, more more happy with where I'm at. Uh, but we also did Soul Silver in about eight hours probably. Although I, I slowed it down because we swapped profiles halfway through basically because I was getting stuck on stuff and wasn't wasn't getting through the third and fourth gym, I think that's the one. Or is it the ones after that? I can't remember what gyms they are, the the ones on both sides of the water that you have to surf across. I I was I, I was struggling on those ones. So my friend switched switched profiles with me and still managed to catch up to me before the Elite Four basically. Even though he was at the last gym and had already done that, so... I did really bad, basically. But anyway, enough of that. Pokemon. More Pokemon. All the Pokemon. I love... I love how he asked me what I want to do and then still does... The end of the fight before I even have a chance to do anything. Um, I think I've already caught this. I'm gonna leave it. Just gonna take whatever extra stuff I get. I, I hope I get extra stuff from doing this without catching it. It's two stars, and I just want stuff. I just want stuff. That's that's all I want. Basically, it's been too long since I last played this. It's good to be back again. Pick it up again if you haven't played it in a little bit. Just gonna explore a little bit more before I move on. I don't need to get everything, as much as I've been trying to do everything. I like getting everything though. <laughs> I like just running around doing stuff I don't need to do. Also, I could climb these cliffs right now to find out what's up there. X is a TM. What was that? Are you a thing? Am I crazy? That's just a branch. What's going on? A root, that is. I don't know what I'm talking about. Stuff is going insane. But mostly just me. I could also try and get some of the stakes I haven't done yet. Also, it's raining. Does that affect anything? I hope not. It doesn't seem like it does. Also, have I caught you yet? I don't think so. No, I have. Okay. But now we can fly. Like, we can glide. We can climb. We can do all sorts of things. It's going to make getting around the world a lot easier. I mean, running's definitely one of the help most helpful ones. Because we can just move faster. But swimming... Uh, gliding, climbing, high jump, they're all such good uh, unlocks. Really. Anyway, they say there's a tunnel around here that leads into the Great Crater of Paldia. That's some good info. I haven't seen this far in the game, so... Also, we can all agree that this guy looks like the other guy, right? I can't remember the name, but you know what I mean. Isaac the Scientist. Sent out Magneton. Also, it's weird that in Shining Pearl and all that, they, like, um, each trainer type has their own theme, but in this game, they don't. I just, I just liked when the, the, the different trainer types had their own theme that played when you battle them, basically. Or at least when you say hello to them at first. I feel like that needs to be a thing, but also the trainers in this game don't automatically interact with you. You have to go up to them and talk to them before you fight them. Which is very different for a Pokemon game. But anyway. Looks like my search is getting cut short. Just like your wallet. <laughs> oh hey, did some- oh wow. Fracture is evolving. And I'm drinking my tea. Fracture has evolved into Hexorus. Looks pretty epic, and it's just dragon type, which is pretty strong. And it's definitely worth keeping, probably. I just also want to evolve some other stuff so I can register more Pokemon in my Pokedex, because that's something I really want to do, is try and get all the Pokemon. Let's go to the boxes and see what else I can evolve. Try and get some more dual types, maybe. Uh, I have Dratini and Dragonair. Getting the next form above that, I think it just requires me to... I leveled it up some more, so I'm going to try and focus on that a little bit. It has an electric uh, terror type, which is interesting. I also want to um, take out a Quaxley and just 
level that up. I want to I wanna have one that I actually evolve all the way to full. We have this one which we got, which we traded for, but I think it'd be really cool to actually have one that we actually just work on all the way up to full level, I guess. Uh, but anyway, it could also be cool to just start a fresh team, like after the Elite, Elite Four or whatever the end of this is. Also, this is interesting. This must be the entrance they talked about. We can't go in there yet though, so gonna have to leave that for the moment. And I guess I'll just take a look at this then. Psychic type, which I think is fine if I use dark type, right? Or ghost? I don't know. I really cannot remember the type types in Pokemon for some reason. Despite having played pretty much like several generations of Pokemon, I should know what types are effective against what, but I still don't for some reason. Anyway, I just need to play more Pokemon. I need to do some other stuff. I really wish I could stream because then I would just do that instead of this basically. Cut out all the editing ever and just st stream. That's the thing about streaming is you can kind of just not have to cut anything ever. As long as you stay entertaining, which is difficult to do, I guess. Uh, anyway. So land it, which I'm pretty sure we've caught before. It is weak to Dark and Ghost, so I was right about that. I'm glad. So I do know some things about Pokemon. Also, that was nice. It's probably just good to do these just to get the rewards from them. Even if I don't catch the Pokemon, it's still just good to do them. Hopefully I'm not missing any of the Pokemon that I encounter here. And just don't... Just don't forget to, skip, to actually catch them instead of skipping over them. But I don't know, it's fine. I'll catch all the Pokemon eventually. Like, once I've done the main part of the game, I can probably go back and just catch anything that's registered in my Pokedex, as long as it's partially registered. If I've seen it before, it's partially registered, so... It should be good. Also, can I please pick up the item? I'm mashing the A button. Why is it not picking up? I don't know. Another TM. Eerie Impulse. I guess we can also follow this path. I'm really just going all over the place and just eventually going to end up where I'm supposed to be. If I had to pick, I wouldn't pick you. Roasted! Anyway, if I had to pick between the hike up the mountain and hike down, it's hike- the hike down's more fun. Well, the Pokemon Center is in that direction, so you're probably going to want to go that way. Hike a mile. Mud's tail. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. Um... Plan B, uh, I guess they're all effective. I didn't think they would be effective, considering it's a ground type, but anyway. Torch Song. I think I need to work on just bringing up the main level of my team a little bit. Despite it already being pretty powerful, if I make it even more powerful, then I don't have to worry about failing at all, so. Also, my Quaxley is leveling up very quickly. Learned Wing Attack, we place a move with that. I press, guess I will, because I've got some pretty basic moves at the moment. Let's get rid of Growl. One, two, and ta-da! Let's learn Aqua Jet. It's also another good one. 40 power, 100 accuracy. And is physical, so that's probably good to replace my pound move. Okay. And there we go, we won. I took a steep fall. Why did it take so long for the message box to show up? Also, hello, I don't think I've caught one of you before. Whatever you are. I don't even know what to- how to even describe this character. So, total. Uh, let's see. I don't know how to do this without taking it out, so I should probably just throw a ball. Actually, I should, should have thrown a quick ball. I have those. One, two... Three. My method of catching Pokemon has changed since last time, possibly. Because last time I would probably just blow it at his health first, which is what you're supposed to do. But I don't know, I've, I've changed as a trainer, apparently, to the point where I just throw balls. Just regular Pokeballs. Also, I don't think Nest Balls are very good at all. Like, really not good at all. I think they could be good, but I don't think they multiply the power of the catch rate as much as they need to, sometimes. Well, I say that and then it catches first try. <laughs> Never mind, ignore me! I'm just here playing the Pokémon. Pokémon plays itself. 
Pokemon knows itself. Ice type, interesting. That's a type that I've probably never had on my team before in any Pokemon game. Other than maybe Pokemon Go, but we don't count that. Also, Quaxley is evolving. Here we go. Quaxio evolved into Quaxwell, the last good form of its evolution. <sighs> I just don't like how much it dances. But there we go, that's all of that registered in my, my Pokedex now, which is good. But I would still like to evolve it, so I'm gonna do that. Let's go pick this up quickly. Max Potion, very worth it. So, are you just a random thing here? That's interesting. I wouldn't have expected that. Just a random Espeon. Can you please fight it? What are you doing? What are you doing to me? So rude. Anyway, I can also just glide over everything. Which is quite nice. Ah, uh, I could explore a bit up here, I guess. There is also a thing if I go straight up from here. So let me take a look at that quickly. Up we go. It's so nice just being able to go up mountains now. It's very powerful, just being able to do that. Also, there's a thing up here. There's also a calcium. That's actually another thing that I probably need to do, is actually just use... Is that a shiny? No. Right? I don't know this Pokemon very well, but is this shiny? Probably not. I don't think I've caught it, though, so I need to catch it anyway. Uh, let me just quick ball this. It just looks different from the other Pokemon that evolves into it, probably, so. But if this is a shiny, that would also be cool. Grievard. Offline Water Pulse. It's pretty good. 60 power, 100 accuracy. Special, it's a special move. Uh, work up. User is roused. It's attack and special attack stats are boosted. That's a, probably a good one to keep a little bit, but not too much. I don't usually use those moves, so... Anyway, let's have a look at this. Registered in Pokedex. Pretty sure it's not shiny. It just looks different from the other one. Just slightly. But anyway. I'm so paranoid of what's shiny and what's not a shiny anymore. How do I open my map quickly? Why? That's the one. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> also, hello. You're interesting. Terra-type Ursang. But what Terra-type is it? The answer may surprise you. Because it's Flying-type. Just a flying bear. What could possibly go wrong? This is my nightmare now. This is... This is... What even? Uh, also, I have to battle it. I can't just throw a ball, apparently. So that's interesting. Let's just Torch Song this. It's only slightly less level than us, so... Pretty good first attack, though. And my special attack rises from that, so... Just flying bears. That does not sound good. Anyway, let me throw a quick ball. Because it's only turn two. So I imagine it's still pretty good. I don't know how good. I imagine if, like, if I was to design the quick ball, I'd have it half its, like, effectiveness every turn that the battle goes on or something. Uh, probably not a nest ball, but I'll try. Yep, that's what I thought. Cool. Finish my tea now. Which is good, so it won't go cold. Let's throw... Maybe a great ball. Just gotta throw every kind of, kind of ball, of it, ball at it until it works. One, two, three, and caught. Nice. Also, my sinuses feel very blocked right now for some reason. And I don't know why, because it was fine earlier today, so... Low sweep. Interesting. It's a fighting type move. Which I'm tempted to just replace work up with. It lowers the opponent's speed stat. The same was registered. Balls from Teddy Guy, so. My Pokedex must be doing really well right now. Also, we got some LP from that, which is good. Please grab, grab. I'm mashing the button. Full restore. Pretty good. Is there anything else up here that I need to know about? 
before I leave. There's a few items. I don't need them, but I'm gonna check them anyway. Ether. There's a lot of Pokemon all of a sudden. Also... I really can't tell if any of these are shiny. <laughs> there really needs to be more indication of what's what. Also, I forgot that I was coming up here for the Terra Raid battle. Just got distracted by the Terra type Pokemon. Flamethrower TM. This is the perfect place to train. I guess it is. I come to ha harsh environments like this to train my body and soul. That's just my style. Also, I like this, the snow effect here. We're not high enough to see the snow yet. Uh, but we're, we're getting there. Luisa the Dragon Tamer. What is this Pokemon? I didn't read this, its name quick, quick enough. Arc tip backs. Oh, that's the best I can do. <laughs> also, why are we this far in the game and there are trainers with one Pokemon still? I mean, that's pretty normal, I guess, but also, I feel like the further into a Pokemon game you are, the more trainers should just have more Pokemon. Especially because it makes it feel like the world is more alive and like they're actually going around catching Pokemon rather than just the Pokemon that they're set with, which is what they are. And that's all that they are, and I feel like that doesn't, that just limits it a lot. And I'd like, I'd like them to expand upon the, the Pokemon world to make it feel alive. It feels pretty good right now, and it, but it could be a lot better. My Pokemon and I were too busy hunkering down against the cold. 4,200. Perfect. It's perfect. We can't, we can't lose. Uh, anyway, let's do this, uh, battle. Quickly. Also, going back to what I was saying about trees earlier. It feels very un-Pokemon to not have that many trees in this game. I feel like that what, um, like if there was to do a 3D Pokemon, like a game like this, but with like an older generation, like if they me remade some generation, but in this style, if you like went into the trees and stuff, you would fight, like you could still go off into the trees and it wouldn't have to, it wouldn't stop you from going that way, but you would encounter harder Pokemon. So it, it's a lot, it's more recommended to stay on the path. And then maybe later on, once you're more powerful, you can come back and go through the, the trees and the dark part of the forest, I don't know. That's just how I would design Pokemon if I was in charge, but anyway. I'd also make it so that the health bar goes down. <laughs> I don't know why that's not fixed yet. I don't even know why that doesn't even just work, I don't know. Also, Trick Room, that's interesting. I'm pretty sure that means that peop the Pokemon that are slower go first, rather than the Pokemon that are faster. And that's actually a move that I probably want to get on my team as well. I I've been recommended this, so... Because I have some slower Pokemon, so... There's just something to keep in mind. I don't know how easy it's going to be to get, but... Because I have to actually catch a Pokemon that can learn it. I don't think I've caught this yet, so I'm going to catch this. Just going to take another minute to catch it, though. Gonna poke a bullet. Oh, I wish I could skip the animation. It doesn't even matter because we're gonna catch it anyway with 100% guarantee. It's so cool. I mean, it is cool, but also makes it take a lot longer than it really needs. Hatrim was caught. All right then. Wow, how many things have I done so far in this video? I don't even know. I feel like I'm at full speed for some reason, despite having already recorded like five videos today for, um, what's it called? Enter the Gungeon. I actually beat a run. I actually, I actually killed the past for once. For the first time, I did that. But yeah, I have, I've, I've been, I've already recorded half of this week's videos today. So I'm hoping to get the other half done now, possibly. Also, hello. You're going to make some good training for my Pokemon. Psybeam TM. Getting a little bit of XP. I would have expected more XP, to be honest. But also, I'm, wow, I'm way up here. I should have, been, I should have been down there, but I sh I'm up here now, so. I should look at the what's in the map to find out 
if there's anything worth checking nearby. There is actually a Pokemon Center right there, so I should actually go to there. Kapow! All my opponents will meet my fists of fury. Kapow, kablam! Okay. Roger the black belt. But you should see my kapow! Power. Because, because that's the true power. And I hope you understood that reference, because I'm gonna... I'm gonna make sure you do at some point. I don't even think I did... I didn't do the sound quite right, because there's... It's supposed to sound like one thing instead of two things. Or multiple things, but yeah. It's a good reference. <laughs> it's a good sound. Kapow! Kablam! Kablam! Owie, that hurts! True. No one can stand up to... Noop ka kapow no one can stand up to it. Anyway, let me see which way I'm supposed to actually go, because there's probably an actual path I'm supposed to be following that I'm not following. But you know what, that's fine. I can climb up things, which is nice. Also, hello. I almost stood right on top of that. Also, Hyper Potion. That's nice to just pick up. Please! Fight the Pokémon! This is ridiculous. Also, br bron Bronzong? I think that's what it's called. I might be worth catching one of those. I can't remember what type it is, but it is an interesting type, and it's... It, it's interesting. <laughs> it's supposed to be like a bell Pokemon. But I don't know if I... I don't know if it's good or bad. I don't know how good it is. But anyway, I might, might still catch it because I need it for my Pokedex. And I can work out if I want to keep it or not later on. I'll just go Quick Ball. I'm not, I'm not that interested in fighting this thing for that long. There have been too many times where my Pokemon, the Pokemon just takes too long to catch. And if I can use the Quick Ball in the first turn, it's good, so... It's almost guarantees a catch every time. Once learn Aqua Cutter, Cutter, which is a physical... special move. A physical water move, that is. Uh, so let's replace Aqua Jet with that. One, two, and ta-da! Steel Psychic. That is interesting. That's very tempting. It would just... It wouldn't really work with my current team, but I, I do want to adjust my current team, so... To something else at some point. Also, there is a Gimme Ghoul here, so I'm going to fight that. I was wondering why there were no, none of the smaller ones, but there's actually like an actual, actual one here, so... Let's just bite that. And get the coins from it. I still need like half the coins, probably, so... I can't just buy the rest. I'll, I'll just end up selling them. Also, have I caught one of you before? Please. No. No, I haven't caught a Mimikyu yet. That's interesting. Well, let's go Quick Ball. <laughs> just get this over and done with. One, two, three. Nice. Also, I wish, wish that the actual like seasons of the area changed. Like, actual time was passing in the Pokemon. That was such a nice thing in black and white. Ghost Fairy, interesting. That's very interesting. Anyway, let me, uh, climb up some more because I can. Oh, boy, unless I slide down because of aiming the wrong direction, but it's fine. Also, what is up here? Is this actually just the Great Creator Proud of you? I should probably not look up here or something. I also, I don't think it'll let me. Quite possibly. Eh. Just a sneak preview. I was trying to actually find the uh, Pokemon Center, so I'm going to try and do that instead of going up this way. Looks like I can go up that way, but I also want to check out over here. What is happening with these Pokemon? What are they doing? Zinc. And Stealth Rock TM. We'll take that. What are you? Oh! Just a random... Hypno, right. Cool. I'll catch that. Quick ball again. I feel like I've made a lot of progress in a very small amount of time today. And I'm gonna take it. Because there's still plenty of the game left and I wanna... wanna hurry up a little bit. I am taking... I'm still taking my time, obviously, by catching any Pokémon I see. But I do also want... To make some good progress. So, 